not trying to be annoying. Yeah, I'm, I think I'm doing pretty well too. I haven't checked this far. Oh shit, I got stuck. Out of the grenade! Dude, nice. <laughs> oh shit! Oh my god. I just nice. didn't even couldn't even see him. I know, I saw that. Oh! You had four HP! Yes sir. Hello. And so it begins. Stream numero dos for the day. Look at that little beard hair right there bugging me. Uh, I got all my dos on the profile. But hello again to Tommy. Welcome back. It's been a long time since I've seen you, dude. Just kidding. Obviously. Uh, here to start the ye olden fucking Arceus stream. Which will make its way onto YouTube, unlike some of the shit that I stream, because I can't be fucked. Also, sometimes I find some of the things that I do kind of cringy. <laughs> Graphics go hard. Uh, do they? No. Oh, you're, you're memeing. Maybe I mute myself for this fucking... Turn this shit up for the cutscene. I don't have to turn it back down, because it'd be loud. Welcome to my realm, located beyond both time and space. I guess I can't mute myself. I'm going to read it off. It is well that thou art here. I am that which humans call Arceus. Yeah, oh yeah, no, you're definitely right. Now, I wish to know thine appearance. Boy. I'm a white boy. What is thy name? Dogger. What is up with this fucking? Why is this not a QWERTY keyboard? Uh, why, how did it take me this long to even realize that? Yup. Doge Llama. Yeah? Soon thou shalt find thyself in a world strange to thee. I find your fucking speech patterns incredibly weird. A world inhabited by wondrous creatures that humans call Pokemon. Why don't you call them Pokemon? Seek out all Pokemon, and thou shalt find me once more. Wait, do you really have to complete the entire fucking Pokedex to find Arceus? Because I thought you would just fight him after the Zolo fight. But I don't even know, because I haven't finished that yet. <laughs> On my own playthrough. I can, I guess, but I, I've been uh, procrastinating. Hey, my phone. Hey, my phone. Okay, Tommy. Catch your lights, brother. Ah. I need to fucking remember to turn this back down. <laughs> but I fear that I won't. Cat alert, major cat alert. Wake up! Okay. Oh, do wake up, won't you? Fine, fuck. Back down you go. Oh shit. 
Oh, wait, what? Why poke the mom? Held a message for misogyny. Gotta catch the milfs. How is mothers I'd like to fuck? Misogyny. And if, if anything, that's like kind of a compliment, isn't it? Like, I guess I get it, but. <laughs> Fucking auto mod. I'm actually kind of like glad for that. But, uh. I mean, like, glad for the auto mod, but at the same time, like, I haven't had anybody actually say anything fucking ridiculous that should have actually been, uh, caught by it. But thank goodness, you seem unhurt. I appreciate you, Supreme. I appreciate you. I, I think I'm still... Oh, no, I had to close... I had to close my, uh... My Chrome, because it does, uh... does interact kind of funky when I'm streaming from the, uh... The Switch. Who are you? Shut up, bird. Bird outside. I'd like to ask you the same. I mean, you fell out of the sky. You'd understand. Come now. Who in the world does that? Well, me, I guess. I must say, your clothing is unusual. You wouldn't happen to have a, an acquaintance in these parts, would you? <laughs> if I doubt it. I don't know. I see. You seem to be in a bit of a pickle. Might I offer some directions? Do you have somewhere around here you could stay? Uh, no. Was not. So you don't know anyone here, and you don't even know where to spend the night. Well, this is a proper pickle indeed. Are you quite sure you'll be able to survive? Somehow, I guess. Sure. I'll figure it out. Why are your Pokemon just, like, forebodingly just staring at me? I see. Well, no gentleman would abandon a person in such need. Groom. Boom. Push splash. Oh my, I completely forgotten. I had caught up to these three runaway Pokemon when you tumbled out of the sky. It's almost as if they knew you'd appear here. Ah, uh, but do you even know what a Pokemon is? Yeah. Fuck yeah. My, that's a relief. But you fell from the sky, it seems like you have some common ground, eh? Yes, well, these three Pokemon belong to me, mysterious creatures that they are. Oh yes, and what might your name be? Dogi Llama. Oh, oh so you're called Doge Llama. It has quite a ring to it. I imagine it must have some lovely meaning. No, it, it really doesn't. Oh, but I do apologize. I haven't even introduced myself. My name is Labentin. I am somewhat of a Pokemon professor. That is to say, I'm a scholar seeking to deepen our understanding of Pokemon. Yes, Pokemon such as these three here. What? Bye. Yeah, uh... Oh, blast and bother. My darling Pokemon, why must you run for me again? I'm terribly sorry, but do you think you can help me round them, round them up? I beg you. Wait, you three, wait! I had the unfortunate coincidence of, uh... I've named my... I've had the name Doge Llama for fucking... A gajillion years. That's not really... Helpful of, like, an accurate description of how long I've had it, but... At the same time, uh... I had it way before Dogecoin was a fucking thing. And when I meet new people, they just assume that, like... It has some correlation, but it doesn't. Or... Or they don't assume that, and they call me, like, Doge, or Dodge Llama, which I don't know. Doge has been a fucking meme for, like, 15 years now. I bestow upon thee this arc phone and thy mission. Seek out all Pokemon. Meet me. But yeah, this is my second playthrough for the game. Eh. First playthrough was so fun that I figured I might do it for stream, too. Just kind of how I wanted to do Animal Crossing as well. I can't even fucking roll yet. Poopy. Sigh. Alas, yet another miss. Aha. I'm glad you come to my rescue, my new friend from the sky. I feel like you'd be much more, like, terrified of a person that fell from the fucking sky. I guess the fact that I look like a... Or, or that I am a human kind of helps out with that, but... Rowlet can photosynthesize like a plant, and apparently it battles using its sharp feathers. Apparently? What do you mean? You're a Pokemon professor. How do you not fucking know this for fact already? You own these Pokemon. That one over there is Cyndaquil. Fire burning on Cyndaquil's back will flare up whenever it's surprised or irate. Foom. That's what I picked for my own playthrough, because Cyndaquil and actually Typhlosion is one of my favorite fucking Pokemon. Uh, or is my favorite Pokemon, I should say. The Pokemon near the pond is Oshawott. Oshawott naps while floating in the water, and it can battle using the shell-like object on its belly. I think I might want to go with Oshawa this time around. Oh my, nearly forgot to cover the most crucial thing, how, how to go about catching Pokemon. No, thank you so much. Here you are, my boy, Pokeballs. 50. 
Uh, but that won't do for an explanation, will it? I do apologize, let me be more thorough. Now that I've mentioned that uh, already that Pokemon are strange, marvelous creatures, what's so strange about them, you might you ask? Well, each and every Pokemon is able to shrink itself down to minuscule size. And that's where Pokemon... Pokemon? Pokeballs come in. Pokeballs are a recent invention, you see. Throw one of those at a Pokemon, and why the Pokemon will shrink down and fit inside the ball comfy as can be. And with that, you've caught a Pokemon. I know we've just met, but I'm afraid I have no one else to turn to. I'd be awfully grateful, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Fucking, uh, okay, whatever. I was going to read all that shit out, but I don't know. Everyone else can probably read as well. Fuck you. Get in the ball. Ooh. Yep, I did. I did catch the Pokemon. It doesn't really say anything of value in the first place. <laughs> Fuck. I thought I could do two at once. Come on. Get in the ball. Doesn't this one break out? Yup. <laughs> oh. This is so sad. <sighs> yes, sir. Dunskies and Dunskies. Thank you very much indeed. Oh, what a relief to have them all back. You see, the three Pokemon you caught have only just arrived at the village to help with our research. They won't yet, uh, they won't yet listen to anyone. I was not the greatest at reading in school, if that wasn't already immediately apparent, because I cannot seem to stay on track. But kind of want to blame it somewhat on my ADHD, but I, I'm, I'm just going to assume that it's... Yeah, me trying to talk faster than my fucking brain can process words. How is it that you can catch... Or how is it that you catch Pokemon so ably when you've only just arrived here? I don't know, probably because it's fucking... You just press one button and then you aim your controller? I don't know, dude. <laughs> fucking... This is how I explain. <laughs> Look at my fucking cool phone thing. I'm gonna take my... Switcher link. I wonder if Twitch uh, categorizes that as me taking drugs on stream, because technically, it is, but they're not illicit. Pokeballs have only just been invented, I'm pretty sure you told us that, and not many have mastered the skill of using them. Enter you, a person with a clear talent for catching Pokemon. It's true. I am pretty fucking rad, huh? Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Pokemon back to the village. Oh, this could be such a... I don't know. I, I feel like so fucking bad when I'm doing the intro to a game, because it just feels like it's a, just a, a serious fest. But then again, it'd be kind of weird if you just started the game part, part of the way through, wouldn't it? I don't know. Maybe so, maybe not. Thank you for your tireless work keeping us safe, my good guardsmen. That seemed to be doing a fucking whole lot of something. <laughs> oh, there's Risk of Rain 2 DLC? What? Oh, I didn't know that. Welcome back, Tommy. Hello, hello. This way, if you please. I might. Oh my god. Jesus Christ, fuck. You bought a new monitor? Oh, shit. The one you were talking about? It's coming this Friday. Did you get a Switch, too? The world we're on now is known to the locals as that bad thing. The village was built scarcely two years ago. There's much to do and not many to do it. You talk fucking fast, and since we know so little of the local Pokemon, people hesitate to set foot outside the village. How the fuck they get here? Now that the impressive building, uh, now that impressive building up is- Fuck! Shit. 
We're not supposed to talk to strangers, you know? Like, you're fucking children. Adults can speak to strangers. Like, we literally have to do it all the time. Oh, botheration. I almost forgotten. I need to go and report that we successfully recovered the escape Pokemon. Might I ask? I didn't mean to skip that. It's just past this bridge here and then to the left, the wallflower it's called. What do you want, Arcbone? No money for the switch right now. Stop on Oh yeah. Hell yeah. Good shit, good shit. Hello. Mystery man. <laughs> what the fuck? Why are you grumpy? Bitch. Well, now aren't you awfully suspicious? How? Fucking no. I'm not like cloaked in like a dark outfit. The wallflower is for galaxy team folk only. We don't have seats for outsiders. Move along. Fuck your shit, bro. Suck my butthole. Akari, who are you? I've never seen anyone dressed like you are. What if you were attacked by Pokemon? You'd be mincemeat in those flimsy clothes. But you're no different, bro. If the guard let you through, you must have ties with somebody in the village. Not village. Uh, I kind of want to exploit something while I'm fucking doing this. Give me un momento. Better than one day. That's probably fine. Yeah, I'm gonna export this shit. <laughs> Forgot about that. Oh, this is so annoying. Why am I doing this? I'm like, doing several by my old broken switch. Maybe it won't take long to buy the new one. Oh god, yeah, I'd be careful about that though, because GameStop's gonna buy that shit for like $20. I was hit by a Pokemon move called Thundershock. I, I'm surprised you're not fucking dead. I wish more of this intro shit was... Oh, 170 pounds? Really? Damn. That's actually kind of surprising. I wonder what they get out of refurbishing and uh, reselling. Because that's kind of nuts. If a new one's like 250 or 300, I think you said kind of crazy that they would even give you half. Excuse me? You plan to appoint him to the survey corps? You just slap a badge on whomever you like without Captain Silene's permission. I'll allow it. <coughs> Let me guess. Captain Silene. Assuming the individual can contribute to the survey corps, that is. I am the captain of the galaxy's survey corps. You may call me Silene. I might. I just might. be 15 or so. You're 15. Fuck you. Who'd <laughs> be quite old enough to work for your keep? Jesus. They're into child labor. That's some shit, man. I started working when I was 15. So I guess I can't really talk shit. I, for the... <laughs> for almost my entire duration of playing my first playthrough, I thought Silene was a man. It did not look close enough, and I, I totally misgendered her the entire time like a fucking dunce. And then I looked closer enough, or closer, I looked close enough, if I could speak again, uh, and I noticed she does have lipstick on. I'm just a dumbass. Not to say that uh, lipstick is what uh, <laughs> defines a man between a woman, but I, I just, again, I'm a fucking moron. Professor Leventin, where exactly did you meet our visitor here? Fuck. The cap is so tight. Yeah, maybe don't go around telling people I fell from the fucking sky. Because they're just going to question your mental state. And then find me even more suspicious. Can I skip this? No. Yeah, 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 yeah. Shut 
Shut up, Benny. You fucking suck. Yeah, that's easy to do when you have a distraction. That's fair. I certainly do. Well, I do some of that. But it, it, for me, I guess it all depends on like my mood. Because I definitely... The only reason I like streaming is because I can stay in my room and I don't have to actually be around people. I'm not really great. Uh, I don't know. It's a hit or miss for me in social scenarios. Like, if I have to be social, like, for work or something like that, it's actually way better for me because I can get into being that way. But if it's just like, hey, do you want to socialize with people? My brain is like, no. No, I fucking don't. I don't want to do that at all. What's my trial? I want to hurry up. I should have named this, like, Wizcubed. How's it going? Is this your first chat? This is your first time chat. Welcome. It's going all right. How are you doing? We're just trudging through the intro to Arceus here. I should, like I was saying a second ago, I should have named this like intro to Arceus. Boring as shit. It's already 22 minutes in. I don't have any friends IRL, so I'm not saving my ass. Some bad stuff. Uh, no, this is actually my second run. Uh, I think I'm like three quests away from like 100%ing the game on my other file. Um, but I'm just running through it again because I, I think this game is fantastic. And uh, typically, well, actually just occasionally I guess, uh, I do runs of games that end up on, on YouTube. So I think that's the plan for this as well. I'm actually, dude, my brain is so dumb. I like, I want to go back to playing Dead by Daylight again like really bad. So I might just do the intro to this game. And do like maybe 30, 45 minutes or something like that. And then actually go back to Dead by Daylight and try not to be like a toxic little douche. Um, but also because it's 1.5 times uh, blood points right now. Which is... I don't really want to miss out too much on that. Yep. Yep. Pretty sure everyone knows how to fucking save. Yes, sir. Atami, why, why are you being, uh... Okay, Atami. Good to see you, too. Uh... Take it easy. Stay away from the bad stuff. I, dude, yeah, Scarlet and Violet? Babe, that's so crazy. I, I missed pretty much... I don't know what I was doing on the day that it was announced. But I, I didn't see that it was announced until, like, late in the night. And uh, I'm just surprised that they announced it so quickly. We already have starters announced. That shit's awesome. You have, what, like, what time is it? You have school? Or you mean making yourself ready for tomorrow? I guess that wouldn't make more sense. But yeah, Scarlet and Violet, that's fucking Pog. It's actual Pog. Another open world game. If they do it any anything like this game, I'm super there for it. I was really skeptical. Uh, before this game released, but uh, I was pleasantly surprised. This game is phenomenal. Oh boy, Captain Silene. Oh, I love fucking talking more. That's that's excellent. Yeah, I did see that it was uh, announced for this year. Which is nuts. Dude, that's actually kind of crazy. We're getting fucking three Pokemon games within like the span of a, a year? That's crazy. Nintendo's doing some fucking work. I really hope so. Well, I don't know if I hope so, actually. Because I, I... I dislike spoilers, but at the same time... <laughs> I, like, can't help myself. Oh, let's get this intro over with. Oh, please. Me complaining about... The intro dragging on is probably not helping too much, but... Here we are. Yup, 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 yup. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, game, game mechanic info. I just, I don't know. Like, for me, spoilers of any kind, like, I'm kind of glad that I went into Arceus just not knowing 
anything besides that it was like open world and it was going to be somewhat like Breath of the Wild esque. Uh, but yeah, I don't know. I I don't uh, I don't mind too many things that like, especially if it's going to reveal whether or not I'll be into the game or not. Like if there's a I don't know how I feel about there being, like, multiple cities, so this seems like it's going to be another game that's based around getting gym badges as opposed to, like, getting stars like it is in this game, and I, I kind of like the way that it's structured in this game, but, um, I don't know. It'd be kind of a nice return to, uh, getting badges in an open world game. That'd be kind of nice. I think we're going to pick Oshawa this time, because I picked Cynical in my own journey, but... Come here, Oshawa. You guys are super weird that they turned Typhlosion into part ghost. I really dislike that. But I am curious, I, I actually have no idea if they changed Rowlets or uh or Oshawats or both of them. If they changed their final forms into um part something else. I have no idea. I didn't check. Sorry, just checking something real fast. Uh... Nice. Fuck off. What? No. South Carolina? I need my butt. My bad. Just getting spam calls. Shit, you know how it be. Yeah, we get it, we get it, we get it. 20 Pokeballs? Hell yeah. Damn, the fucking intro to this game is like a half an hour. Plus this like intro quest or task, whatever. It's probably like a 45 minute intro to the game. That's not that bad though, considering some uh, some tutorials of games are like fucking two or three hours long sometimes. Which is ridiculous. Hi Zolo, you stupid nerd. Well, you... Timed at 43? Okay. Oh, did I call him Zolo? Not Zolo. Fine. Is everyone commenting on my appearance when they all look like this? How am I the one in the weird clothes? I'm just in something like... <laughs> Super, like, I don't know, really minimal. Oh, thanks. I appreciate that, Wiz. Yeah, I definitely will. I'll check you out for sure. Have a great day. I'll see you around, hopefully. I appreciate the reminder, too, to help uh, smaller creators out. I, I do so uh, already, but yes, I will definitely keep that energy up i i'm definitely a fan of helping out and supporting people that i appreciate their content and then also that you know come around and support me as well 
Very kind, very, very kind. I'm fucking stoked to go back to Dead by Daylight, though, to be honest. I uh, don't want it to sound like I'm not fucking into this, but I've been feeling Dead by Daylight lately. This is our base camp. Yup. <laughs> Card. Bruh. Please. Please. I understand. Hi, Akari. We just talked like fucking three minutes ago. Freaking nerd. Come here. Yep. Thank you so much. I'm walking my ass through this shit. I, I get it. Oh, hello. Flash, that was terrifying. Whatever, bro. You didn't see me. You're a little liar. Yes, sir. Was the last one? Oh, Shinx, that's right. <laughs> yeah, I've, I've, I've done that. how ass this was. Goals to battle. Goals to battle them. Even though two of our Pokemon are, are extremely weak. It's against this one fucking type. Excellent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I'll have to use video if I go. It might only need a tackle. Or quick attack, I guess. I forget though. Bonk. Double bonk. Capture bonk. Oh, I said you passed the trial with flying colors, and it seems you went and did just that. Congratulations, Dogeton. You take your first step towards seeking out every Pokemon. This calls for a commemorative photo. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> you never see that photo, right? Well, uh, to be fair, I've never actually used the photo booth in town. So maybe you do.
In time, you'll be able to send Pokemon you've caught to live in village pastures. You can bring up to six Pokemon with you into the field, in theory. Though we never had anyone skilled enough to do so. <laughs> what? Hello? It's not Dilly Dally. We have to go eat our potato mochi. And waste your time with more useless tutorial garbage. Wee. How It seems we won't have to leave. Whoa. It seems we won't have to leave you to die after all. Congratulations, you passed your trial, you can hold on to that satchel. Thanks. I must admit you've impressed me. I set a high hurdle to judge whether a stranger like yourself could be worthy, but you cleared it. It really wasn't that big of a deal. This is yours, the official uniform of Survey Corps. The Survey Corps, I should say. Thank you so much for the garbage uniform. Mm, okay. Oops. Could you imagine? So hands you like the fucking set of clothing and you just sprint straight at her fucking desk. There you go. It's like, well, maybe I <laughs> judged you too soon. You seem capable of catching Pokemon, but not of basic eye hand coordination and motor function. Yup. Oops. Yes, sir. Can fresh as fuck. Excuse me. Hello. Give me that hat. Thank you. Okay. How long? I don't know why I do that all the time. It's like my shittier ideation of a catchphrase, I guess. I've been waiting for you. I am Kamado, commander of the Galaxy Expedition Team. Okay. Hmm. So you were a Doge Yes. Herm. I've been briefed on your situation, including how you fell from the sky, uh, ripped from the sky. Now then, let's see what you're made of. Face me in combat. Okay. Yeah. Ouch. <laughs> my ass. It's literally so much fucking intro text. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Appreciate it. So the commander has also accepted you. It would, uh, it would appear that way. But understand this. You begin as a no-star recruit among our, among our ranks. In other words, you have no rank at all. Perform well as a member of the Survey Corps, and you will move up through the ranks. Indeed, you see, the more you add to the Pokedex, the higher rank you will become. And working on the Pokedex will also, of course, bring you closer to that goal of yours, to seek out every last Pokemon. Here, you will need this. A recipe. Thanks. And 300,000, <laughs> 300, Jesus, 3,000 Poké Dollars as well. You will have to buy the necessary materials. No, I won't. I won't find them. I'm like a good boy. Akari, you are an expert at crafting yourself. Teach the new recruit what he needs to know. Of course. Yeah, 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 yeah. More tutorial garbage. 
Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Thanks, pals. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, maybe I should do this one before, uh, before we end off this. Well done earning a place on our team. My name is Ant. I'm a local clover. Professor asked me to go through the... Uh, that I'm ready to change of clothes, so here you go. I do hope they fit. Wait, what? Oh. Dear God, why am I yawning so much? Stop. Akari, how did you get out of the... Never mind. <laughs> you were behind me. You can use the workbench here to the cra uh, at the craft works anytime you need to make an item at the village. Okay. Thank you. I've literally never used this crafting bench. Outside of probably the tutorial. Which, it, yeah, I believe it forces you to. Uh, do I make all 20? I suppose so. Woohoo! Oh, uh -huh, now it's some fine craftsmanship. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah, fine. Wahoo! Paper Pokedex. Yay. Okay. No. Beauregard. Yeah, you can do that. You want a warrant bell? Dude, he's yawning. Nope. I don't know what a fucking warrant bell is. What the hell is that? That, that, that just makes me realize this dude asks you for a wormhole that he can evolve, and then he does not evolve it a single time throughout the entire game. Hello. Yeah, I can do that. I have one. Do I have to complete the Pokedex? No. Do I have to give this to him, though? No, appears not. Chomp. Easy game. Freest three potions of my life. What do you want? Also easy. Oh, I have to complete the Pokedex entry. Okay. Well, I figure I'd just do the uh, stinking intro to the game. For the first episode, because it'd be boring as shit, and then uh, it'll be easily skippable. Wait, what? I should get ready and head outside. What the fuck do you mean? I'm not gonna do that. Fuck your face. I can still save though, I believe. Uh, as long as I choose the right menu. Bonk, bonk. Cool. Thanks for watching. This will be up on YouTube. I will. Uh, I'll be back <laughs> again <laughs> in a little bit. With uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna play some Dead by Daylight again and stream it because I'm a stream junkie. What the hell is this? Is that my drop frames? I hope not. Okay. Bye. <laughs>